So in 2012, you decided to do something different with your plan design. What was that, and how did you come to that decision? Well, we're firm believers in that the market will drive, and, and our employees should have the right uh, to shop for health insurance the same way they shop for anything else and, and, and those type of services. So we implemented uh, the tier system, and so we were able to hold the employees' premiums level, and we pay about 70% of the cost. The employee pays approximately 30. And if they were in a tier one, which is the least expensive, or maybe least expensive isn't the right terminology, but a lower cost, a alleged lower cost, then um, they would forego the thousand dollar deductible, and we, if they participated in the wellness program, they did not have an increase. Those that don't do not participate in the wellness program pay about ten percent more for their premiums. So we built in a sort of a step to try to sort of hit them in their pocket and get them, get them in, uh, engaged in the process. So I've actually found surprisingly that a lot of people don't really, uh, aren't really that familiar with the tiered product. So could you describe it for us, how it works, um, what it means for choice and what it means for the employee? Well, um, we, we, as everybody heard earlier, we're with Tufts and the tiered product is within their networks, which is somewhere in the 98, 99 percentile for all our employees. So a person can go any place. Uh, the Boston teaching hospitals tend to be a tier three, and if you choose to seek uh, treatments there, you will pay for the first $2,000. Conversely, if you seek a tier one hospital, which Leahy is, Winchester Hospital is, where many of our employees are, you will have no deductible. And so that's sort of the difference. The person has the ability to decide what they want, where they want to get it, and um, hopefully be a little more educated. 